Welcome back to Mason Talks. So one of the players who has performed really well for the Browns during this preseason is rookie running back Demetric Felton. Now, Felton is in kind of an awkward position because he's taken snaps at wide receiver, he's taken snaps at running back, he's done really well, and quite frankly, there's just not really a clear, defined spot for him on this roster. Because if he plays wide receiver, he's going to have to find a role somewhere between Odell Beckham, Jarvis Landry, Donovan Peoples-Jones, Rashard Higgins, and Kaderil Hodge. And obviously, if he goes to the running back position, there's not a ton of room for him there either with Nick Chubb, Kareem Hunt, and Dearnest Johnson. Demetric Felton just doesn't really have a great fit with this team right now. So what are the Browns going to do with him? I think they're going to develop him into a star. Now, let me explain why. When you look at Demetric Felton, I think his skill set is really unique because he's clearly a running back. I don't think that he really looks the part of a wide receiver. I think part of it is his height. Some of it's just his frame. I mean, he's kind of built like a running back, a small running back. So I think he's going to have to play running back if he wants to have a long career offensively. And I think he has the skill set to do so. Because when you look at the modern NFL running back, some of the most successful players at that position have done so mainly because of their ability to catch the football. I mean, there are stars at the running back position who, quite frankly, probably could play wide receiver. I mean, Christian McCaffrey routinely has a ton of receiving yards. Alvin Kamara is another very good pass catcher out of the backfield. Even Kareem Hunt on this very team is one of the better sort of dual threat running backs receiving and running I think that right now in the National Football League, you can be a star as a running back by catching the football. Now, that is not to demean the talents of guys like Nick Chubb or Derrick Henry who can just bull rush you, run right over you. But if you're a good pass catching back, there's a chance that you could end up being a star. And I think that right here with the Cleveland Browns, even with his lack of a defined role on the depth chart, I think this is the perfect place for him to develop into that star. And there's three reasons why. Number one, he has time. If Demetric Felton didn't play his entire rookie season and simply devoted himself to to improving or, or whatever, that'd be fine. I mean, the Browns wouldn't really suffer that much because of it. The Browns have plenty of talent at running back, as, as we've already gone through, plenty of talent at wide receiver. If Demetric Felton didn't play, it, it'd be fine. We have time to develop him. And obviously, it's going to be good that he is going to play. Uh, I, I, you know, knowing Kevin Stefanski, the smart head coach, I'm sure they're going to find ways to get him on the field, use him uh, as the weapon that he's kind of shown to be. But he's got time. There, there's no pressure behind Demetric Felton. The Browns have plenty of depth at both of the positions that he can play. So number one, he's got plenty of time. Number two, he's got great coaches. And this is something that I think is truly a a testament to where the Browns are at right now. I fully trust guys like Kevin Stefanski, Alex Van Pelt, Stump Mitchell, the running backs coach. I believe in these coaches and their ability to develop talent. So if Demetric Felton truly has, and I know this is an overreaction after two preseason games, but if he truly has the potential to be a high caliber offensive weapon, the Browns have the coaches to get that talent out of him. They have the coaches who are smart enough to give him a routine or a, a, a you know, a, a schedule or just some sort of method to get that talent out of him. So coaching, number two, very important. Number three, I think he's got a great role model right now, a couple of great role models on this team. The first one is Kareem Hunt. If Demetri Felton's going to be a star, it's going to be as a receiving running back. And as I noted before, Kareem Hunt has been very successful as a pass-catching running back. I mean, the Browns have used him in sets where he's been split out wide. They've used him straight up as a wide receiver, like we've seen with Demetri Felton in this preseason. And I think that Kareem Hunt is somebody who Felton can look up to 
as sort of a role model. Like, if, if Demetric Felton can turn into a running back who is very good at pass catching like Kareem Hunt, that obviously, it, it would be great. I don't think he has as high of a ceiling as a pure runner of the football, but if he can get catching skills like Kareem Hunt, that'd be great. And then the other guy who I think is a great role model, quite frankly, for every rookie on this team, is Rashard Hollywood Higgins. And the main reason being... Rashard Higgins has basically shown that if you're going to be willing to put in the work, it doesn't matter who your head coach is because Higgins has seen, you know, as many head coaches as Baker Mayfield. He's seen like, what, four head coaches now? Doesn't matter who the coach is. Doesn't matter who the general manager is. If you show hard work and if you produce on the field, you'll get your opportunities to shine, even if you have a stacked position group like the Browns have had at wide receiver. When the opportunity arises, Higgins capitalized on that. And I think that's a great thing to show guys like Demetri Felton, who might not have a massive role in his rookie season. If an opportunity arises for, for Felton to get on the field, he needs to know that he can capitalize on that and he can get you know future contracts because of that. So looking at this team as, as a situation for Demetri Felton and looking at his talent, I think that if he's going to hit his ceiling and become a a you know highly versatile offensive weapon wide receiver slash running back combo, I think this is the perf- perfect place for him to do it. And quite frankly, I think we might look back in a few years and say, you know, how on earth did Andrew Barry get him in the late rounds of the 2021 NFL Draft? From what he has shown in this preseason, Demetri Felton looks like he could be a, a very useful offensive player. Let me know in the comments, what do you think of Demetri Felton and his long-term fit with the Cleveland Browns? Do you think he can be great? Thanks for listening to the Mason Talks Sports Show. I'll see you in my next episode. Goodbye.